Alright people, hello and welcome. Today I got some happy news for the users of Asus ROG G750, possibly 751. Nonetheless, I found a way to control the fans. Now for some that maybe not be a big issue, just nothing usual, nothing special, just something there is, but for some that's a fucking fantastic news because I always wanted to do that and now we're finally able to do it. The program is called Notebook Fan Control and it looks kind of like amateur and really fake at start because even the site that I got it from wasn't really looking too good but it works. However, once you install it, you'll see you are greeted with this window and you don't have anything here. So first thing you want to do is click on three dots and look for config and you'll see that there is no Asus rock. And by googling a little bit I found out that you should use Asus Zenbook UX32LN, click apply. And then you'll be greeted with this. Now there's another catch over here. The GPU fan, which is on your left side of the laptop, if you're facing the monitor, is actually marked as GPU over here. And the CPU fan, which is in real life on the right side, and it's GPU, it's marked here as CPU. So GPU is CPU fan, and CPU is GPU fan or processor is marked as GPU fan and graphics card are marked is marked like CPU fan got it got it fantastic and also if you want to monitor temperatures I advise you to use this program called God's sake uh, I don't know what to call it HW info 64 and when you launch it you'll be greeted like this so here you can see about the processor other than that you can see your info and if you click on sensors you'll see shitload of information let me just guide a little bit here is your basically RAM this is your processor from temperatures to ratio to thread to thermal throttling let's hope we don't have that the CPU temperature, the CPU package, which is basically the place where your CPU is, but just look at this for then your GPU, then your hard drive, second hard drive, if you have one, and so on, uh, optic drive, and then whatever you have here, battery, etc. It's really great, fantastic, and yeah, that's about it. So finally we can control the fans with this amazing software. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye.